Okay, it's time to replace the Jiku M20 with the Jiku A40. Let's see what we got inside. There's the specifications. You can take a look at them. Two 5-watt speakers, Bluetooth and USB modes, just like the last one. I like the volume dial that's going to be added to the top. And of course, you got your RGB lights. Let's open this up and see what's inside. You have your destructions manual, and you have an adapter to go from USB-A to USB-C. We won't be using that. Here is our speaker. So I can tell you right off the bat, this has a heftier and higher quality feel than the M20. Let's plug it in and see how it works. So we'll turn it on. Bluetooth mode. It starts out in Bluetooth mode. Let's turn on our television here so we can sync it. Already got your RGB lights rocking on the sides there. So this is like an infinite rotating. Oh, it's all the way up. You can hear that it's beeping, saying it's all the way up. Let's get into the settings here and go to our Bluetooth devices, other Bluetooth devices. We're going to add a device searching. There it is. GQA40. Device paired. You hear that the device is paired. Let's go to YouTube. Pull up the lo-fi girl. All right, so one of the nice features here is that this has a it's touch sensitive up here. So you can change from your different color modes here. You can see those color modes changing. Now they're off. Now there's a multicolor. Bluetooth mode. So you've got a lot of options here. You can sync it with your phone or a tablet. I've got it plugged into the power supply and Bluetooth link to this television. But of course you can do that with your computer as well. So all in all, I think the A40 is a great upgrade if it's something that you're looking for. You got your cool lights and everything. You got, you've got this touch section up here where you can change the colors, which is really cool. I like that. And I think it's another great buy from Jiku.